Hi! This is an application of the limit loss. It's a word problem that says the changes in the economy of the Philippines, specifically inflation, have been monitored to follow the function f of x is equal to 3x squared minus 4x plus 5. With this trend, at what percent will the inflation rate be after two years? So because of this given, that means x will now be approaching 2. Let's solve this using the limit laws. First, uh, the most obvious rules that we will be applying or the laws that we will be applying would be the difference rule and the sum rule. Let's get the limit per term. So the limit of 3x squared as x approaches 2 minus the limit of 4x as x approaches 2 plus the limit of 5 as x approaches 2. Again, what we used are the sum rule and the difference rule. Next to that, we have squared. Therefore, this will be the power rule. And then we have numerical coefficients, which will require us to use coefficient rule. The goal is to get to the identity and constant rule. So we'll have 3 times... Sorry, this should be a parenthesis. Limit of x as x approaches to quantity squared minus 4 times the limit of x as x approaches to plus the limit of 5 as x approaches to. This is now by coefficient rule, by power rule. And we can now simplify. Kasi meron na tayong identity rule at constant rule. So we have 3 times 2 squared minus 4 times 2 plus 5. We have 4 times 3 is 12 minus 8 plus 5. That's 4 plus 5. Answer is now 9. Now we're asked... How many percent, di ba? Therefore, we are approaching 9%. Ang laki pala na inflation rate natin after two years if this would be the trend. Now, what does this imply? This now would tell us na after two years pala, yung mga presyo ng bilihin na, na meron tayo ngayon, tataas sila by 9%. Possible na ganon. Um... This means na dapat sana ngayon pa lang inaayos na ulit natin yung minimum wage ng mga earners para dapat uh, itaas na naman siya para makasunod sa inflation rate at sa pagtaas ng mga bilihin, sa pagtaas ng cost of living para hindi ganun kahirap ang mga nararanasan ng kapwa natin Pilipino na sumasahod lamang ng minimum wage. Isa pa lang yun sa mga applications ng ating pinag-aaralan. So I hope that in your performance check, you will be able to look for other applications of this lesson on limits. And in our next video, we will be discussing about um, direct substitution, the last method in solving for the limits of functions.